perfectly placed stones leading to a simple yet elegant structure. There is a profound and unique appreciation for the impact of beauty on the human senses in Japan. It's called Kondo. Kondo describes this Yamaha piano that represents more than a century of unmatched musical craftsmanship. Kondo is also used to describe something else bearing the Yamaha name, where the impact of beauty on the senses is in direct proportion to how hard you twist the throttle. Hamamatsu, Japan. It was here in the year 1900 that Torakusu Yamaha crafted the first piano ever made in his country. Until 1900, pianos arrived in Hamamatsu by sea, at great expense having been purchased and shipped all the way from Europe. That would quickly change as Yamaha began exporting its pianos. By 1904, a Yamaha piano would be on display at the World's Fair in St. Louis, Missouri. Today, at the Yamaha Motor Company Museum in suburban Hamamatsu, the company still honors its history as the world's largest piano manufacturer, with a baby grand sitting center stage. Yamaha developed special metal technologies that were used in the design and manufacturing of pianos, and after World War II, the company realized it could use its special technologies to make motorcycles. A three-pointed tuning fork is Yamaha's logo. It is more than simply a connection between music and machines. It's a constant reminder that Kondo, the impact of beauty on the senses, is at the very core of the company. Atsushi Ishiyama is the keeper of the flame for Yamaha's design DNA. He's been designing Yamaha motorcycles for more than 50 years. When I designed the first Yamaha motorcycle, it should be a very beautiful machine, a very sexy machine. Utilizing its research into metal alloys used in piano construction, Yamaha decided to get into the motorcycle business in 1955. Its first motorcycle was the YA-1, a 125cc single-cylinder bike nicknamed the Akatombo, the Red Dragonfly. This is the very first Yamaha. At that time, most of the motorcycles in Japan were painted black, and there was little attention being paid to the language of sculpture and design. Literally weeks after the first YA-1 Yamaha rolled off the production line, the company took it racing and won the 1955 Mount Fuji hill climb. The Red Dragonfly carried a powerful sting. Simple, light, compact, powerful. Simple, light, compact, powerful. That has been our design concept from the very first motorcycle and it continues to be our concept today. Just two years after its first motorcycle won at the races, Yamaha introduced the YD-1. Once again, Kondo was an important part of the design process, and the tank was intentionally painted white to make it shine brightly in the sun. The YD-2, our first two-cylinder bike, is very much a Japanese original and not based on other motorcycles imported from other countries. The YA-1 was partly based on a German motorcycle, but the YD-2 was completely a Japanese design. Another uniquely Yamaha design was the DT-1, the first motorcycle in the world designed from the ground up as a dirt bike. Yamaha called it a motorcycle you could ride beyond where the road ends. The DT-1 was first sold in 1968. It was really popular in the United States. During its first 15 years in business, Yamaha built every bike with a two-stroke engine. In 1970, the company took a major risk in building its first four-stroke motor. 
The bike was the XS650, and like all the larger displacement models that would follow, its condo was created by making the bike lightweight and compact. It's very narrow. The knee grip is tight. It's a very organic design. The rider's body can fit into the machine completely. The bike and the rider become one. For some riders, the ultimate condo can best be found in the heart of a full-blown sport bike. In 1985, we built our first sport bike, which has evolved into what is the R1 series today. One of our designers created this bike. Its shape is like a bullet, a bullet in the wind. The headlights are like two eyes. Much of the inspiration is taken from observing nature around us and like living creatures in the animal world, lions and tigers, this motorcycle has two eyes. Yamaha was late getting into the motorcycle business in Japan. But perhaps its success is partly the result of its condo. Today, Yamaha is the second largest motorcycle company in the world. And all your senses will come alive with a twist of the throttle.